Hello and welcome back to another banknote. Um, again, we have one that I'm not really sure about. Um, well, geographically speaking. But um, other than that, um, I can. French? Well, it says da. I'm not sure that is French, but it's something in, along those lines. Uh, maybe it's Portuguese. Probably is Portuguese on this one, but still. Um, and the country is that, and I have no idea, not if it's Portuguese at least. And again, I don't know this country, don't know where it is, except it should be in Africa, but north, south, east, west, sorry, no clue. So let's focus on what is here. Um, well, we have 1,000 in all four corners, so that is nice. Um, it is, well, 1,000 pesos, mil pesos. Well, that's mostly in Spanish, but uh, yeah. And we have this, I don't know if it's a scene from something uh, in their history, but we have a group of Africans, I think, uh, with various items. Kind of over here, it looks like they're having a feast or something. I see what looks like bananas and pineapple and things I don't recognize, but mostly food. Um, there is someone with a bow in the back. I'm not sure what that pointy thing is. Um, also, they are somewhat naked. Um, kind of an odd choice to have naked people on your banknotes, but uh, to each his or her own, I suppose. Over on the other side, um, dude with a horn, a paddle of some sort, a spear, not sure what that might be. Could that be a basket with fish, maybe? A um, drum or some kind of instrument as a kid? I'm not sure if they're facing off or something like that. Like you guys have the food. We have some weapons, we're here for the food. I don't know. But it looks interesting. And in the middle you have like a victory ceremony or some sort. There's like a guy draped in a flag or cloth of some sort. And there's a horse. So that's interesting. Uh, it says something about triumph. So maybe it's related to independence or something? Maybe when they fought for independence against, well, let's say Portugal? Hmm. Could be. Could be. Other than that, we don't really have anything. There is a bit of blank space over here. There's like a some fire there on the pattern, but this is all blank. I do see something, but I guess that is uh, from the other side. But yeah, interesting. I don't dislike it. Um, it's an interesting choice, but definitely kind of cool. So yeah, the other side I would say is a bit more traditional when it comes to banknotes. Again, you have the one thousand, except for this corner. There's a. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Coat of arms of sorts. Patterns going around. Uh, some kind of dude. Maybe that was his name. The Militar Cabral. Something like that, maybe. Who knows. The 1000 pesos, the serial number, governor and vice governor signed 1993. March, maybe? I think that might be March. I'm pretty sure this is Portuguese. That C with a thingy underneath. Yeah, that's gotta be Portuguese. I think they use that only in Portuguese and maybe Catalan. But I don't think they conquered anything in Africa. So let's go with Portuguese for sure. Um, I'm not sure what that is. It looks like maybe a woman with some kind of headdress. And then there's a guy working on something. Weaving, maybe? Could be. And again the fire thingy. And some empty space. So maybe not a big fan of the colors, they're kind of darkish. But still not too bad. So yep, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Until next time, bye bye.